I think the most important thing that somebody needs to do is research the studio that they're getting tattooed at. The studio should be immaculately clean, uh, preferably published extensively. Um, and you can totally tell a lot about a studio just by either their local reputation or their national reputation. Um, any articles that their artists or the studio might have um, a lot of the sterilization issues are ones that, that if you ask, like here at All or Nothing, if you ask, they'll take you on a whole tour of it, you know, like here, come check out. Because we go to excessive lengths to ensure sterilization, to ensure that there's no cross-contamination, and um, it is important. There's a lot of important factors to getting tattooed, though, that are more art-related. Um, Nowadays, especially uh, with the high level of art that's being put out in this country, the majority of the studios are very clean. It's very inexpensive to, to do a clean tattoo. So it's, it's not near the issue it was when I started tattooing 17 years ago. Nowadays, um, most shops are clean. That doesn't mean all of them. Um, but if I were a new client, the, the first thing I would want to look at is portfolios. I'd want to see stuff that the people already did, whether it's published or not. And I'd want to definitely verify and make sure that whatever style of artwork that was happening was exactly what I wanted. Because um, there's such a wide variety of art and such a wide variety of execution. You know, when I first got tattooed, I just thought, I'll pick something off the wall and it'll be perfect. Well. That's not true. There's really no reason to do that anymore because now the sky's the limit. Art has no boundaries and there's nothing that we can't tattoo.